J8, California, United States. <laughs> we just <laughs> escaped our hotel room here in Turlock. It was a very interesting experience, but uh, I think we both don't need something like that uh, again soon. <laughs> nice weather, blue skies. Um, a former student just um, and friend said that uh, contacted me. Uh, he wants me to help him with his helicopter, putting the blades on. But it's in Hayward, so what a bummer that we didn't stay in Hayward last night. So we have to figure out where to stay next day, uh, the next days, and then I might go to Hayward. But we want to we go to the Oktoberfest in Oakdale, which is more or less the opposite direction. So we have to figure something out now. What we're gonna do? We go first. We go to Modesto and pick up her car. Maybe I go to Hayward alone, and she says a family. I don't know. We don't know yet. We don't know anything. So let's see. Just arrived in Modesto at the orchards where Leanne's car is. Still don't know what's going on. Um, Eric wants me to help him with his blades at Hayward Airport. Um, he's not responding right now, so I don't know. Um, tomorrow I don't have time because the plan is um, to go to the Oktoberfest and we have an appointment to look at an apartment. So I don't know if I go to Hayward alone or with Le uh, Leanne or... I don't know what's going on, as usual. Okay, I just had the contact with Eric again. I will meet him on Sunday at 1 at Hayward Airport to get some work on this helicopter done. And now we are checking motels to stay for the next two nights here in this area. So let's see. I hope we don't have to spend too much money because, oh man, everything is super expensive. Yeah, we just had a breakfast lunch at IHOP here in Modesto and I'm stuffed. What about you? I'm super, super full. I don't need any more food. Yeah, she didn't even finish. So she had to pack up everything. Okay. Um, but we are good with food now. Now let's uh, check out the food. And then let's get some work done, like washing clothes and getting applications for the apartments done, uh, which is the most important thing right now, I guess. Just back at the hotel where we stayed before. We're pretty lucky that we get the um, discount rate again because usually this hotel room here is $130 plus tax per night and somehow, um, yeah, they like my German accent or they have some German visitors here and they get the special rate. It's uh, either called government rate <coughs> or construction rate. So you get, um, instead of paying 150 or something per night, you just just pay $93. It's still a lot, but it's a good hotel room. The breakfast is okay and we can wash our stuff here. So it's kind of lucky. Could be worse. Yeah, we just checked in our hotel room and we expected actually the similar room that we had. But this room is more or less triple size. So I really hope we are having the same rate uh, like last time. Uh, I'm a little bit worried, Leah not. But have a look at this crazy hotel room. So there's a, actually an extra room. And we have two TVs mm -hmm. and a desk and a sofa and a nice bed. And everything is clean. And everything smells really good and is clean and looks new and everything is working. So... Uh, we are pretty happy with it, or lucky, or I don't know, but it's just amazing to have a nice room after what we <laughs> experienced last night. So everything happens for a reason, super bad last time, super lucky this time for the next two nights we're here, and we are pretty happy. Oh, so relaxing in this hotel room with a carpet on the floor and uh, we are actually able to shut off all lights at night without being worried that the animals are coming out at the corner and stuff. So we just finished our first application for the first apartment. It took us two hours. Leanne is there right now and um, giving that to the person who's deciding at the end to uh, get their apartment. They want to know stuff. I can't believe it. Three last places we lived with all the information about the landlord. Uh, two different bank accounts with exact what you have in there, what kind of money. 
Uh, God, and then you have to pay sixty dollars for each person, so for Leanne and me, uh, that they can make a background check on you. Um, you have to pay for it, even if, if they choose you or not. How ridiculous is this? So I really have a hard time get used to those regulations and all those requirements you have to follow to get actually an apartment here. So I have don't have a job, so they wanted to have all my pilot license certificates, so a copy of those. And I'm very happy that Leanne is working right now on a on a job, and uh, this employer gave her all information we needed. So it's, uh, it looks like she has a really good job. So yeah, first step to get an apartment. Let's see how it works out, and time to relax a little bit after cleaning up here. To wrap things up for today. It's 7 p.m. Leanne is gone with her girlfriend somewhere. I don't know where, but I don't need to know necessarily everything. Just went to the supermarket, cleaned up here, get everything ready for the laundry. And yeah, no more plans for today. I'm just updating my resume so I can send it out to more or less every fried school around, including, I don't know, Oregon. Las Vegas, Southern California, whatever. Even if we might get an apartment here in this area soon, which is more important. It's actually not important, it's 50 50, it doesn't matter. Um, and then go from there. So, tomorrow is another day. Still a lot of stuff to do, obviously, to get settled, but we will make it. Everything is good with a better hotel room where you can. Feel good, relax, and yeah, call it at least home for two days.